Good evening, I'm David Kramer at the National Weather Service with Alaska Statewide Weather. Starting off for the remainder of the day, we have high pressure nosing in out over the western portions of the Bering Sea, keeping much of the shower activity further to the east out over the eastern Aleutians and Alaska Peninsula. And over mainland Alaska, we are expecting isolated showers to develop this afternoon into the evening hours with thunderstorms over much of the west coast through much of the interior. And there are also some red flag warnings out for the central and eastern portions of the interior that will last until 10 p.m. tonight. But those thunderstorms could kick up additional wildfires in the area. Up along the Arctic coastline and eastern locations, we have some isolated rain showers. Then down in south central Alaska, we're going to have some showers developing, especially over the mountains. Down in the Panhandle area, some rain is going to be expected up from the Yakutat area through all out the, throughout all of the Panhandle. For tonight, a lot of that is going to clear up, but just some areas in the southern locations still seeing some lingering rain. And then southeastern areas of the mainland part of the state going to see some rain, especially in the higher elevations, with rain diminishing in the evening hours for the interior going to start to taper off as we move further into the night with some isolated rain showers lingering around the Seward Peninsula and down in the YK Delta area. Down in the southern portions of the Bering Sea and along the Aleutian Islands and Alaska Peninsula we're also expecting to see some lighter showers with another low pushing up some rain closer towards the Alaska Peninsula. On Monday going to continue to see a front push up towards the area bringing more rain to the Alaska Peninsula and then we are going to see some lighter showers throughout much of the remainder of the Bering and Aleutians. Out over mainland Alaska, expecting to see some showers throughout many locations. Should be lighter with the exception of areas that could see thunderstorms again throughout much of the interior down into the Alaska Range and in some places of the YK Delta, expecting the potential for thunderstorms to exist, especially in the afternoon and evening hours. Down in the Panhandle area, we are going to see some continued rain in that area as we do some high pressure lingering out over the Gulf of Alaska, keeping the rain over the Panhandle. On Tuesday, we are going to see that ridging pushing further to the east, clearing out some of the areas along the coastline for the Panhandle, but we are still going to see rain in most of the locations. It's going to extend up along the North Gulf Coast through Yakutat area and some areas throughout south central and southern portions of the interior, with some uh, thunderstorms expected in the afternoon hours again for western portions of the interior, extending down to the YK Delta. A frontal system is pushed up towards the Alaska Peninsula from the North Pacific, bringing rain to Kodiak Island and the Alaska Peninsula, and we're going to have some lingering showers out over the Bering Sea. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm David Kramer.